Welcome, and today I'm going to walk you through in Canva how you can edit the social media planner to make it your own. Hi, my name is Ruby Donsnack, and I'm all things about be it marketing, digital marketing, you know, making money online. If that's the type of content that you like, then please give me a like and a follow, subscribe, and put your notifications on so that you get notified when I come on next. Okay, so let's get into Canva and we are going to have a look at how you can edit this uh, social media planner to make it your own. Okay, so here we are in Canva. Now this is the social media planner and that's the first page. So if you want to say change the, the color, if you just click on it, which I make that a little bit bigger for you guys, how's that? The color is up here, so you can just go and click on that and it brings up all the other colors. So uh, we won't go purple, but say you could, you could go maybe a beige and that changes the color just like that. But we'll just go back to the other color. So that's that. Now you can just click on the color or if you want to, you can just go back to this arrow here, which will bring the same result, okay? Now with the uh, text here, you can just click on it. As you see, there's the size, that's the text that comes up. If you wanted to change the text, all you've got to do is click on that and it's going to bring you up a multitude of different text. Now, the thing about editing in Canva, it's best to use only the free stuff, all right? So this, let's change it to Montserrat, which is free. So if I click on that, there you go, it changes, all right? Um, now we can change it back by going back here. And I just wanted to show you, so if you were, say, to uh, use this one here, it's got a little crown, as you see. And that's the same with all the fonts, all the um, photos and elements. There's certain things that... Uh, not free, you actually need to be a subscriber to Canva to be able to use those things. So everything in this social media planner is all editable and you can use all the free elements and there's heaps of stuff in the free elements or the free, uh, and I'll just show you in the elements here. There are so many things that are free. So if we just go here, just wait for that to load. Uh, taking a little while here but anyway it should all come up there we go they're starting to pop up now so let's go to see all and here's some photos so as you see when you hover over it it's all good now if you were to hover say on this one here as you see little crown popped up and it's got pro so that means that you actually need to be a subscriber to be able to use that uh, particular item or icon or photo um, in, your, in your stuff, okay? So that's just to show you there. Uh, I'll just show you a few more. So we've got um, a few templates here. And yeah, so, you know, it's all editable. If you've purchased it, you just need to click on the link, follow the instruction sheet, just download it and make sure that you um, have Canva open and you can just click on the link. It'll open in Canva. So make sure you have an account. You only need a free account. You don't have to have, you don't have to pay for the account unless you want to, but a free account is absolutely fine. So create an account if you don't have one, then open the link and download your, um, you know, your planner and then you can mess around with it and put in your bits and pieces that you want. Okay, so I hope that was useful and we will stop that share. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed all that. Thanks for watching. As I said, if you like this type of content, please make sure you give me a like and subscribe and please put your notifications on so that you get notified when I come on next. Thanks and bye for now.